<laughs> but yeah, <clears throat> how you doing? Who's seen? So the government have answered the petition. There was a petition put out to for them to release the grooming gang investigation that they've done. They've done an investigation into the characteristics of the offenders of the rape of our children, and they've refused to release it. And the reason they've give is that they, in their little small print, it says extremists may try to uh, sow division in communities. And then they go on to make the point that they come from, these, these offenders come from all different ethnicities and backgrounds. Well, if that was the case, you'd release your report and no one would be able to use that information to sow any seeds of division. You're still hiding it. Um, just have more your bix <laughs> China is an asshole. <laughs> and um, who? What you all doing for lo lockdown, eh? Nice COVID cut. I know I'm at microphone stage, and I. I'm at microphone stage with a ginger beard. With a ginger beard. But um. I'm loving the uncensored life. It's great, isn't it? <laughs> I can't wait till I can just walk around the streets. I might do a little live. We'll do a VK Live Luton. VK Live Birmingham. VK Live different towns and cities where we can just go live. But it's good. And I just need to migrate all of our people from Telegram or from our email list onto here. So share this everywhere. Let everyone know this is where I'm going to be. This is where I'm going to be putting my sweaty. Who I get, my routine at the minute is my son gets up with me and we do a we wake everyone else up by shouting and doing the equivalent of a cell workout. What people do in jail to try and keep fit during this lockdown. In fact, I think we're out then. We'll go for our bike ride later. As far as we can go, my legs are killing me every day at the minute. So yeah. All good. All good. And what about Majid Nawaz? Majid Nawaz, what Majid does, he's quite clever, is that after a terrorist attack, he comes out and he's very strong against the terrorists and he stands on the side of the people and he portrays he's this big supporter of free speech. And yesterday, he absolutely humiliated himself. He criticised me without actually having any information. I gave a speech called The Rape of Britain, at a libertarian event in Russia. Yes, I went to Russia. Yes, I met many, many different journalists and many different groups and many different people. I actually have received an invite back to Russia, obviously, this uh, to speak in their derma, the, the equivalent of their parliament, to give a talk at parliament, um, which is triggering lots of people here. Now, oh, he's a Russian asset. The speech I gave was at an opposition organisation who are targeted by Putin's government, they say, um, and they were completely opposed to Putin's government. But yet, Majid didn't do any research, just, oh, here he is, look, Russian asset. Russian asset, what Majid forgets is that I actually spent time in Quilliam. I know a lot about Quilliam and a lot about you, Majid, yeah? <laughs> and a lot about your religious belief. And the fact that you talk about me working with Russians, Bro, you're funded. Your main funders. I know who your main funders are. So Saudis. Not really the great human rights supporters, are you? Know what I mean? Not really the... Uh, but Majid, yeah, you've humiliated yourself. So Majid, if you do believe in free speech, which I know you don't, if you do, get me on your radio show. Same with Nick Ferrari. Always wanting to shout, chat his mouth off. Won't have me on. Won't give me the ability to chat my mouth off back where I might throw a load of facts at him and the reality for his listeners to listen to, so they can make their own mind up. See, what they've took away is my ability for people to make their own mind up. They're not just censoring me, they're censoring you. So get on over to VK, spread the word, we're on VK. Anyone who's ordered a China is asshole t-shirt, asso, um, then they've all been sent out. The post is a bit delayed because of the current coronavirus situation. And wait until you see the John Sweeney t-shirt I'll be wearing next week. John, you're probably stalking me and following me on everything I do as a bitter old drunk. So, mate, I've got a T-shirt coming for you, bro. Um, share it everywhere. Majid, get me on your show, mate. Stop being a coward. 
Stop slagging me off and talking about me. Stop using your platform that you know I don't have to condemn me and lie about me and chat shit. Because your whole statement and your whole thread that you done was out of bollocks. You didn't get anything right. Not even who I spoke or the event I spoke at. You said it was a, rop, a, a, a Putin government propaganda film. I, fuck, I sat in my lounge yeah, for two weeks preparing, going through the information. And what you probably don't like is that I prove in my speech that this is Islamic. That these rapes are related to Islamic scripture and teachings. You tried to distance everything from that issue. Your main, Quilliam's main goal when we started, when I left the English Defence League, was to separate myself from Pamela Geller and Robert Spencer. They could not debate Pamela Geller or Robert Spencer on any issues, none of them, because they would lose, hands down, they're cowards. So, and to anyone, I've just seen a Russian name and a Russian follower there. Hello, Russia. We don't think you're the big bogey country that our government wished to try and pretend you are. We actually would rather you more welcomed into the West as you're as well. And I come to your country. I had an amazing time. Um, it's a beautiful country. So, yeah. Whilst we're not in the Cold War anymore, Majid, you might want to catch up, mate. And, um, you know, <laughs> anyway, look, it's good to be here. Yeah? Poland. Is it Vieta? Czech, Chin Doble. I look forward to coming back to Poland for the 11th of November. See you all soon, yeah? Oh, just loving the fact I can go live. It's great. Share it. Piers Morgan is an arsehole as well. They all are. They're all cowards. They all talk about me but won't have me on. Piers, last time you had me on, you looked like a moron <laughs> to all your own followers. Magic, get me on. You'll look like a moron and all. Have a good day, everyone, yeah?